Oh God, it's hard. It hurts. It's coming on me too. We oh, were no, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh. What's going on, everybody? We are so excited to start season five of Bardown Beauties. Can't believe we're here. We are downtown St. Paul. Herbie's behind us, cheering us on. We're gonna take the hot ones challenge. Why? Because producer Fred absolutely loves to torture us. Kirsten, our takes are always spicy. Now we're really gonna be put to the test. Yeah, I really feel like I have to put my money where my mouth is, quite literally, today. Um, I'm anxious, I'm nervous, but we're here and we're doing it, our so. Stay spicy, that's what we're gonna do. Hot takes coming all season long, season five of Bar Down Beauties. Let's dive right in. First up, we have the Hot Ones Classic Chili Maple. It is a 1,600 Scoreville heat units, whatever that means. So, wing number Let's one. Let's do a cheers first. Cheers. Cheers. Pretty good, pretty good. Not was, too bad. I'm gonna take a second bite quick. That was actually good. Yeah. How many goals will Kirill Kaprizov have at the end of the regular season this year? 45. 45, that's uh, more than he had last year. I'll say 46. <laughs> Are you joking? You just one yeah, up to me. I just one up to you. RIP Bob Barker. All right, let's move on to wing number two, the Curry, Curry Verde, 6,000. SHU, which again means absolutely nothing to me. It'll probably mean something different to my mouth. Mm -hmm. Wing number two, Kirsten. Um, another cheers because I'm getting nervous. Okay. Okay, that one's not that bad. Good flavor. Is Dean Evison in the hot seat? Cool. Well, you know, if he were down here with us, proven how hot in the hot seat he will be, that doesn't make any sense. I think you will see that change come January. You look at Bruce Boudreaux, he made it through February. A lot of changes tend to happen. I think he's going to be eyed particularly on how he sets his lines, what changes he makes, how many opportunities is he giving some of those younger guys. So it's warm. His seat's definitely warm. I'm not ready to call it a hot seat until maybe December. What do you think? Um, after how this off season's been and Bill Guerin also showing his support for him at the end of season meeting, I don't think he's in the hot seat right now. I would say maybe next season, maybe, but not this year. The Krabby Shack, a zesty lemon pepper, 15,500 SHU. I know you're pretty excited about this one. I am, and also I don't know what 1,500 SHU means, so I'm gonna let it's that go over my head. It's an increase from 6,000 is what it sounds okay, like. Okay, those numbers. <laughs> so I don't know. <laughs> but yes, I love lemon pepper, so let's do this one. <laughs> that was very lemony. Almost more lemony than peppery. That one's not spicy at all. Wing number three question. If you had to marry one wild player, who would it be and why? I like how it's had because, you know, like you wouldn't choose to marry him or anything. Just because he's not married, I'm gonna say Matt Boldy. That's surprising. I, I thought for I sure you were going Jonas Brodeen. Oh, missed no, opportunity. I married, so I will never marry one of the wild players. Can I revoke my nope, answer and nope, do that? No. Nope. <laughs> But Dang. because I'm married, I feel it's appropriate that I could choose a married man. I would choose Marc Andre Fleury. Ooh. I want my husband to be in the Hall of Fame, Marc Andre Ooh. Fleury. The Chile Lengua de Fuego, the Chichu Ghost, 36,500 SHU, which again sounds significantly warmer than what we have started at. So, got a nice board back here. We've got a cute thing going now. Okay. I don't think that one was spicy either. For wing number four. <laughs> Sorry, I went down my throat wrong. <laughs> Is it getting better to be a woman in sports? I mean, you want to be able to say yes. There's always going to be hurdles, unfortunately. I don't think we're ever going to see a time when it's not difficult to be a woman in sports. But I've always been very fortunate, surrounded by some really supportive people. Producer Fred, we give him a hard time. Again, he likes to torture us, but he's one of those people. Because I think in addition to having women supporting women, you do need the men to help support you and lift you up. And I think in Minnesota, we are great, grateful to have guys, Kevin Gorg and uh, Joe O'Donnell, all those people that support us. So I'm very fortunate. I think it's probably better than it was 10 years ago, but I think in five years, it'll be even better. Thousand percent. Um, I've been really fortunate to have 
mostly just positive experiences all across the board. So I'm doing better than Fred thought I was going Fred to. Fred predicted four. He did. He was in really a seven for me. me. So far, it's, yeah, my, I'm, I'm doing okay. I don't even think I've really taken, we haven't taken a sip of water yet. No, because water makes it worse. So wing number five is the Hot Ones Los Calientes Rojo. 49,000 SHUs. 45,000? 49. Oh, even, oh, even, even better. more. Even more. <laughs> Notice you gave me the saucier one. So no, this one's pretty saucy too. That's kind of like a barbecue flavor to it. I didn't taste the barbecue. Tongue's starting to tingle a little bit, but it's all right. I'm feeling something in my belly and I don't know what it is, and so I'm kind of getting worried, but my mouth feels okay. You have to keep one, Zach Parisi or Ryan Suter. Who, uh, Zach Parisi. I go on vibes, and so I'm going off the vibes for Parisi. I'm gonna go Ryan Suter. Ha <laughs> ha! I'm not kidding, I would go Ryan Suter. I think we lost. Skill-wise. Skill-wise, better. Moving on to number six, the Spicy Shark. Uh, Mako Snake, 71,000. SHU, um, I'm excited. I'm excited for this one. I don't know what I'm feeling. My mouth feels okay. My tummy is kind of yeah. My tummy's spicy. I think we're we're doing we're doing pretty good. That one's kind of sweet. I don't like that one. Jesse, oh. pronounce this Russian word. Oh, that's not fun. Oh, I feel that in the back of my throat. <laughs> Pronounce this Russian word. Brose. 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 I don't like that one. Shoot. Brose. Brose. Oh, I'm crying. <laughs> Ooh. I don't like that one. I don't like it at all. <laughs> I don't like it. <laughs> now I don't like ice cream either. <sighs> There's bees. There's a lot of bees. <laughs> it's falling apart. All right, we just finished six. Moving on to number seven. From 71,000 SHU all the way up to 103. This oh my is God, the wind is blowing on my tongue and it's burning. <laughs> I don't know. This is the... Adobo Loco Jalapeno Chico. Yeah, it's not great. It's not a comfortable feeling, but uh... <laughs> All right. <laughs> Just sear through the print. Just sear through it. We're almost there. It just kind of keeps like dripping out of your out of your mouth a little bit. We've been crushing it. We got I know, this. but that came out of nowhere. I mean, it didn't. It, it came out of nowhere. <laughs> I'm scared. We only got four more. I don't know if I can do all four more. <laughs> I haven't even bit it yet. <laughs> it's got good jalapeno flavor. Good jalapeno flavor. I taste the jalapeno. Yep. Seven is a butte's challenge. Which butte can tape their stick the fastest? Probably not me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, when producer Fred says ready, I'm gonna tape over my already taped job. And go. No, I feel like I wasn't ready. Ugh. Stick tape sucks. <laughs> no. I've never taped a stick before. This tape's like molded. You gave me the bad one. I didn't I didn't know what I was doing. I've never taped a stick before. Somehow this has taken away the pain. Honestly, kind of. Kind of. Why was the other one so much worse than the jalapeno? Yeah, that jalapeno one was pretty good. Ah, ooh, that was almost bad, sorry. <laughs> I think I won. No, I'm trying to break it off. Okay, I'm done. I don't know how to rip the tape off. Ow. Ow. My lips hurt. It won't come undone, but I did it. Okay, this is, 
this is the one. This is the one that makes people cry. Oh no, I don't wanna cry. <laughs> so this next one, the bomb, um, is 135,600 SHU. My tummy hurts. It's, uh, it's gonna be a good one. Jennifer Lawrence cried. Shout out to Jay, Jay Law. Um, I'm doing this because she did it all the way through. Did she do all 12? Yep. Yep. I'm not that brave. You're that brave. I am brave. Or at least scared. I can eat spicy things and my mouth won't burn. No. I feel like it hasn't come yet. It's all right. Um, oh, I'm feeling it. You got the question? Oh, it was my turn? Yeah. <laughs> Sing the State of Hockey anthem. Okay. <sighs> oh God, it's hard. it hurts. It's coming on me too. We oh, were, no, no, <laughs> no. We were raised with a stick and a pair of blades on the ice, ice we cream. cut our teeth. We took I our knocks to the penalty box. box. Our mother was the referee. The wind just hurts it more. Take some ice cream. <gasps> this sport was here before we came. It will be here when we're gone. Oh God, this is so good. I feel like that cured me. The games me. of our blood and the bloods <laughs> in our game. Lay us down under a frozen, frozen pond. We will we'll fight to and defend help. and stand and defend. defend. Our, I want to rip my tongue out. <laughs> Take more ice cream. Oh. oh God. Here, I'll feed you. I get just hanging there. I feel. Mm. Vanilla bean. We were born the child of the strong and wild. We're the state. The state, the state of, of hockey. My it lips just keeps burn. Is my tongue red? Uh, Yours is white. Like it's just underneath. Mm -hmm. Underneath it really hurts. Get more ice cream. There's two spoons. This is a good idea. I questioned it for a minute. A good idea. Ooh, yeah. All right. <laughs> you have ice cream on your chin. You look like Santa Claus. I'm dying. I'm dying. <coughs> oh. <laughs> I think my lip is starting to sweat more than it was earlier. Alchemy peppers, watermelon ghosts, um, 641 SHU, 641,000 SHU. I was gonna to say be clear. 641. We're going way down. Okay. Whew. Oh, I almost broke Why do I always thought people were stupid to do these things? Like, why would you go through we didn't that? Cheers. Sorry. It's tradition. It's tradition. I don't like that one. Uh uh. Uh uh. Uh uh. Where are your napkin? Are you a napkin? Towel. No, I need to spit it out. <laughs> Sit on the ground. Sure, sure. No person. <laughs> That's not so bad. Didn't like it. The yeah, the flavor the was The taste not great. was worse than the spice. Most embarrassing moment in a locker room. I mean, I think I've probably had many embarrassing moments in a locker room. Uh, we could start with stepping on the logo. That's a big no-no. You know what I no mean? No. Like that's a no-no. Um, I also have uh, found out. I can't. Oh. It, I'm watering. I'm just. I'm dying. It's fine. Here, we're good. You keep talking. I'm gonna pour water in your hand. Teamwork. Good idea. This is teamwork. Producer Fred warning you. Me putting water in your hand. Oh. I'm gonna do that too. Yes. We'll just. This is fun. Have fun. Um, and then I think I didn't misspell the name in, uh -oh. incorrect, or no, I had an editor one time. Ooh. 
changed my story and put in the name of a coach who was no longer with a team, which would have been fine, except Devin Dubnik called me out on it when I was in the locker room. I was mortified. Uh, and that was a nightmare. Not as much of a nightmare as some of these sauces are, but. Um, but there is a video of me that went viral from junior hockey where I was doing an interview and the person I was interviewing had a big snot rocket coming out of their nose on live TV. Oh, yeah. And then they wiped it off and then, yeah, a lot of people saw that and then it was on bar down and a lot of things. Oh, yeah, that's not great. Uh, okay, we're on the last dab. And <laughs> just so you guys know, a last dab doesn't mean you dab before you do it. That was news to me too. Everybody so. was, I'm sure, wondering. Thank goodness we cleared. So what are we supposed to do with the last dab? You dab one last bit of sauce on it. Well, schmutz. All right, this one. The last dab Apollo doesn't even have a score, which means that's good. Are you sure the other one was scarier? Just a little. I'm trying. See, I'm being so careful, nothing's coming out. <laughs> Oh, that tastes awful. <laughs> Nothing about that was good. I don't know what's about to happen. It literally tastes like acid. I, I feel it in the back <clears throat> of my throat. Yeah, there it comes. There it goes. Oh, God. Uh, which view can lace a hockey skate the fastest? We've already laced them up. <coughs> uh, Fred didn't think we'd make it this far. He didn't. He said I did. would get four. Yeah. Oh, and that is our season five preview. More spicy takes to come all season long from our lips to your ears. Um, hopefully our lips will not be swollen or any problems with them after how hot and spicy these truly were. Very fun, I'm glad we were able to do this. I'm breathing wrong and I think I'm starting to talk about the list because everything hurts. I do, I feel like I went to the oh, dentist. Oh, I'm crying. It was like... <laughs> it's kicking in. Fire down beauties. We do this for you. Season five. Here we go. I need more ice cream. Like you can't breathe, you know, like that's the problem I'm having. It's like the lack of ability to breathe normal, like you said. It's now sinking back into the back of my tongue. It's creeping up the front, like the tip. <sighs> like, yeah, I don't want my tongue to touch anything. How long does this last? Like, what are the, uh, what are the, how long does the side effects go for? 